Trebek, Manhattan WABC The NYPD advises those attending the annual Halloween parade in Greenwich Village to expect heavy security, with thousands of police officers deployed around the parade route. The show of force comes on the one-year anniversary of the deadly terror attack on the West Side Highway bike path in which eight innocent victims, mostly tourists who were simply trying to enjoy the beautiful fall day in New York City, were killed. He passed me, hit me and kept going, victim Rachel Barnes said. And I couldn't see anything much further down once I was on the ground. The truck came out of nowhere, barreling down at a high rate of speed and striking runners and bicyclists. I suffered a broken foot and ankle. I think the most important thing is to do what we did, was to honor the lives of the people who we lost that day, she said. Mayor Bill D. Blasio visited the scene of the attack Wednesday morning to pay tribute to the victims. You took a horrible situation that could have gotten much worse and stopped it and protected lives, he said. We know, of course, of the story of the Argentine friends who were here celebrating together and it was a wonderful moment suddenly turned horrible. The trial for 30-year-old suspect Saifolo Sepovi has not yet begun, but he is pleaded not guilty. By Wednesday night, though, 6th Avenue will be painted with thousands of fantastic costumes and almost a million spectators, full of goblins, ghouls and anything under the sun. But as much time and creativity as participants put into their costumes and floats, law enforcement put even more time and expertise into keeping everyone safe. Last year's parade happened just hours after the attack, and the city made every effort that night to let the parade go forth. And it did, without incident, much to the credit of the NYPD and brave New York.